Hey, what's going on everyone? This is iReviews back with another video and today I have for you guys the part 31 of the top 10 city tweaks compatible with iOS 10 up to iOS 10.2. So if you enjoyed the video, please leave a like and also subscribe if you haven't already. So let's get started. You play in ground tube. This is an awesome tweak. It will let the YouTube app play in the background. So you can see here, if I play this video, if I go out of the app right now, you can see it still will play, so it won't stop the sound when you go out of the app, it will play in the background, this is really awesome. And also, don't forget to check out my latest iPhone 8 concept, I will leave it linked right down below in the description of the video. App Locker. This tweak allows you to lock your apps using a passcode. So you can lock any of your apps, the stock apps, as well as the third-party apps that you have on your iOS device. So you enable the tweak right here, then you go to General, set a passcode right here, and then you can go ahead and lock applications from here. Just go to Applications and enable any of them. And you can also lock your folders. So you go here, you enter the folder name, and you can lock that folder. Another way to locking your apps is just hold the apps and send them to the edit mode and then you will see these locks right here. So you just tap there on the corner where the lock is and then it will show you here this pop-up. You All you have to do is just enter your passcode, click lock here and as you can see it will lock that app. Usage Bar X. This tweak allows you to customize the look of the usage bar. You know the usage bar that shows up here. So for example, when you're recording a voice memo or when you're on a phone call and you get out of the phone app, you will see the usage bar right here. Normally it's a red big bar up here, but you can customize it using this tweak. So you can see here, let's try to record a voice memo here. And when we go out, you can see now it will have a transparent look. You can see it only shows here recording. It doesn't show that big red bar and you can change that to different styles. So if you go to the settings of this tweak, you can use a slim bar. You can completely hide it or you can use this transparent one that I was using on my device and it will also work with the maps apps like for example if you have google maps and it's using your location in the background it will show it here on the usage bar better messages this tweak allows you to customize the stock iMessages app of ios so you can see here on the messages list you can hide the contacts as well as the preview of the messages if you go inside the message here you can see you can change the color of the bubbles also you can change their shape and you can do all this from the settings of this tweak so if you jump to the settings of better messages here you have all this stuff that you can hide and then here you have the balloon stuff so you can change here the shape of the balloon also you can change their color and you can also add a sending progressive bar so when you send a message it will show you a progress bar and you can also change its color right here Brightify. This is a tweak for the Spotify app and what it does is that it will add this nice layer of white color to the Spotify app. Now normally the Spotify app is black always, it has like a kind of like a dark theme but with this tweak you can make it white like this. As you can see it looks pretty cool so after you install this tweak you don't have to do anything on it, you just install it and it will apply to the Spotify app. Folders Clear 10. This tweak will remove the background from the folders. So you can see here when you open a folder you won't have the background around the icons that are within that folder. But it will keep the blur so you can see the background is all the way blurred and it looks really nice and clean. To install this tweak you will need to add a repo which you will find in the description of the video. I8 Corners. This is a simple tweak. What it does is that it adds rounded corners to the screen of your iOS 10 device. So you enable the tweak right here and you can set the corner radius using this slider. No paper legs. You know when you set a wallpaper on your iOS device it has that nice parallax effect but of course that will drain your battery and you can disable it using this tweak. Of course you can disable it using the no motion feature on iOS that is a stock feature of iOS but that will also disable other animations on your device. So this tweak will only disable the animation of the wallpaper. So you can see here I can set a wallpaper to perspective but when I go to the home screen and move the iPhone you can see the parallax effect is gone. 
Quick Shift. This tweak allows you to change the position of the dock. So you can see right here, the dock just looks like it's just another row of icons. But you can see when you move through the pages, this is the dock, so you can change its position. Also, it will hide the background and you can also hide the dots of the pages. So here you have the settings of this tweak. You enable it here and you can set the height, the position of the dock with the slider right here. Quick now playing. This tweak allows you to see what song you have playing in the background. So all you have to do is just use an activator gesture. So here I have the double tap on the status bar and it will show me the song that is currently playing in the background. So it will work with the music app, the stock music app, as well as Spotify and also a lot of the famous music apps. So that is it for this video guys, I hope you guys enjoyed it, for more videos like this make sure to subscribe, also don't forget to follow me on my social media, you will find all the links in the description of this video.